Good morning, this is Big Lou. I am in Key Largo, Florida. In this video, I'm gonna tell you what it's like living in Key Largo. Um, well, for one thing, it's a very nice town to live in. Um, there are some restaurants, some bars, some shopping centers. I'm not sure if there are any clubs, but there are some hotels. And motels. Um, the weather here is nice. It gets cold, but not as cold as North Florida. And of course it doesn't snow. It's also a perfect place to retire. And the people that live here are very friendly. Of course, there was a lady that, that's walking her dog. She waved at me. She said hi to me. So. Some of these homes are on stilts. Concrete homes and some are made of aluminum. such as the one on the right and the one next to it is made out of concrete. Um, yesterday I was in Fort Myers and doing the, the video of the damage of the buildings, you know, I was doing the uh, a video of damages from the hurricane, Hurricane uh, Ian. And I couldn't find any place to eat. And of course there was no gas, but if you're in Fort Myers or if you're on the West Coast, look for any major hotels or just call them and ask them if they have a restaurant that's open or ask them if they have generators. If they do have generators and if they have a restaurant, chances are the restaurant is open. And you can go eat there. Um, if, those, if there's no power where you live at, find a friend that has power and stay there for a while. I know some of you got to work. Um, boy. And I know a hotel for some of you can be costly. Or find an Airbnb. Find a place on Craigslist that'll rent by the month. They, they, they might rent you a room or a studio for less than 500 a month, you know? But in Fort Myers or along the West Coast, you, you could find one for less than 950 a month. So, you'll probably be without power for a month, you know? Maybe more depending on where you are or what the status is with the electricity. Um, 
But Key Largo, they only suffered, uh, they only had some rain, maybe a little bit of, you know, debris. But I don't think they lost any power whatsoever. trailers uh, there's no damage to the, to the trailers <coughs> oh. Paradise Pie Paradise Point no unauthorized entry all right, please. all right so I'm not gonna go through here it's private property Sun is out. And there are some diners, such as uh, Waffle House. They have a Denny's down the street. If you don't want to pay too much for food, if you're, if you're on a budget or, you know. Hey, it's your money, you know, spend it however you want. If you're into fishing, there's a charter fish. There's uh, there's several bridges to where you can go fishing off of. Um, It looks like there might have been some flooding because I see some water on the side. But other than that, it's not too bad, you know. At least they got power, you know. But over here, there's a little bit of flooding, but it's not too deep. So the water is receding. Just gotta be careful here. But try not to go through water because there might be some sharp objects underneath and there's a chance that your tire can get flat. So try to avoid it if you can.
also try to avoid the sun while you're streaming so that your phone doesn't overheat or your camera. Yeah, they're back to normal. You know, I see a little bit of garbage on the side. So the people with the keys, you know, they got really lucky. I'll tell you. Yeah. The trailers don't look too bad. And if you have an electric car, forget it. If there's no power, you're not gonna be able to charge your, your Tesla or any other electric car. So, electric cars are good to have, you know? So, you don't have to put, I mean, they don't, Spend, you know, some of them don't use gas, but you know. I mean, yeah, Tesla's a very nice car. But they're over $50,000. I think the cheapest one is about 55000 Thank you.
another neighborhood that I like. It's pretty peaceful and it's very close to the ocean. Oh, they have a for sale sign and they're selling a house. Um, I'll show you that in a minute. I want to show you guys something. That's a nice house right there. And they're building a house right there. And the one that's over there that has a view of the ocean. <sighs> that gray house. I like that house right there. Here's the house that's for sale. That blue and white house. And this is the number. As for Kevin Cornell, 305-619-0458 or go to kevin.j.cornell at gmail.com. It's got a one car garage. Very nice house. It's definitely more than 550,000. Even if it's a two bedroom or three bedroom. 
you're not going to get one for less than that. Unless it needs some work done. Alright you all, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, and share the broadcast. This is Big Lou signing off, and I will see you on the next one. Bye.